Today, uh, Kahirluk, uh, I'm raising the case of the thousands of patients in chronic pain who found out uh, over the last couple of months that the Versatis patch is no longer available to them on the medical card or on the drug refund scheme. The decision by the HSE to withdraw the pain-killing patch, uh, Versatis, from these patients is having a huge effect on chronic pain sufferers. This decision means that if you have the money, you don't have the pain, but if you don't have the money, you either go on to morphine patches or you consider taking a drug that is not effective or you, you remain in pain. Uh, when we talk about patient-centred health care, this must also include empathy and respect. And one man is only off the patches for one week, and he's already seen a massive reduction in his quality of life. Many of these users of these patches have already been through serious illnesses and medical procedures. Then we have to ask the question if these patients who will no longer have access to the patch will now have to go back to the pain management clinics. And I raised last week here the confusion surrounding the waiting list times for the pain management in Galway University Hospital. But this is an example of the HSE attempting to save money, but which may end up clogging up the services which are already under pressure. I have another patient who's just in her early 30s she cannot move. She's absolutely dependent on these patches and she's been waiting since July 2016 to get to the pain management uh, clinic in Galway and she's been told that she'll have to wait at least another 15 months. So I want to ask on behalf of the patients who are receiving other similar long-term uh, products from the HSE that they will not be treated in such a disgraceful manner. I really think we need to have a full debate in this House around these patches and the impact that they're having for people who are in absolute chronic pain. And I know that you'd say that the HSE are responsible for this. I think the Minister needs to intervene here on a humanitarian ground for these patients. There's thousands of them across the country in chronic pain with arthritis and, and, and other conditions. Thank you, Kairla. Thank you, Senator.